Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here, another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be going over a quick tutorial of how to insert color or fill a shape or area with color in Microsoft Paint. And this is going to be a more fun tutorial, um, pretty straightforward. And it's something that I think a lot of people would be interested in knowing about, especially if you don't have Photoshop or another fancy tool like that. Microsoft Paint is actually very powerful and it can do a lot of different things that people probably are not even aware about, or at least most people aren't. So I wanted to do a brief tutorial about this one specific feature that I thought people should know about. So I'm going to open up Paint here. So we're going to start with a simple shape. So let me say I want to make a circle here. Let's say I want to do an arrow and and let's say a hexagon. So at this point, you want to select which color you want to fill the images with. So right now, we currently are set to black. So you want to select the color you want to fill it with. So first close out of any shapes you're working on. It would just highlight the outline of the shape. I mean, if you want to do that too, that's great. But we're going to be showing over how to fill an image with a certain color. So I'm going to select green here. So I'm going to select the paint icon underneath tools, or actually above tools that goes by the official name of fill of color so I left click on that you know, let's say I want to make this arrow green makes the image green let's say I want to change it to red for the next one I just made it red so let's make the circle red and let's make the hexagon orange so we can see we just did that so pretty straightforward example there However, I did want to do a little bit more of a complex one. So let's say we wanted to, for example, do countries of the world. We wanted to highlight certain areas that are a little bit more tricky to define. And it's not as simple as a square or a rectangle. So I have an image of the world that I'm going to put into paint right here. Okay, so let's say we wanted to color certain countries of the world here. So let's say we're going to make um, Russia. We'll do this light blue. And then we'll make Greenland orange. And then we can do like sedan in red. So while it's not necessarily perfect with how it renders certain colors with these kind of images, it does give you a good idea of some of the capabilities and functionality that you can do within uh, Microsoft Paint. I know some colors it's less noticeable than others with these little dots. However, the better the image quality is, the less likely we're going to have problems with that. But this just gives you guys a rough idea of some of the capabilities of Microsoft Paint. So, I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.